safety and security first, trying to keep out anybody from obviously taking stuff from the businesses and their families that worked hard for it. Workers doing what they can to keep thieves out while the cleanup process continues at Papa's Plaza. What was once an area where people would come eat or do laundry is now unrecognizable. This is the worst I've seen this building. People who have come by Papa's Plaza are shocked to see just how much damage was done to this one area. You can see right over here in this area, hotels, they don't have as much wind damage to them. One worker telling me it's been emotional for business owners. Emotional, crying, sad. He spent his whole life working to achieve this. John Bencher is a general contractor who was visiting the site. He said it could be years before the plaza is up and running again. You got to get a structural engineer here and, and see what's good and what's not and take it from there. Papa's Plaza owner told me when he first got here to take a look at the damage, he said it made his stomach sick. Now he hopes that the damage can get repaired quickly, but so far he says he's heard it could be up to $2 million worth of damage. He hopes that they can just rebuild off of the structures they already have. Reporting in Daytona Beach, Deborah Cho, Fox 35 News.